Saturday morning. Obviously I can't video at work. So I know there's a few of you that said just video anything. <laughs> so uh, I just thought, you know, I haven't got Olivia this weekend. I have her every weekend bar one um, and it's this weekend. So, you know, we usually do something. Um, I really wanted to go wakeboarding this weekend because it's a beautiful day, you know, getting pulled around a lake. I used to wakeboard for about two years every every weekend. Um, you know, I'm not too bad at it. But my fingers in bits. Uh, it's not too bad today, but it was... Um, Wednesday, I can't remember. Basically, what happened was, I, told, I think I told you, I think I said I was going to be working on my own one day, and I was. So I chucked a mix in. Uh, no, some bloke got on the mixer before me in the morning, um, and he filled the tub right to the brim. And I asked him to help me pull it out of the way, and he was like, "Oh, it's too heavy, too heavy." So me being me, I tried to pull it out of the way on my own, <laughs> and uh, my finger. My middle finger, <coughs> what happened was, <coughs> where I was holding it with my left and right hand and I've tried to drag it over to the left, because to, to, you do like one side at a time, drag one side, drag one side, drag one side. And uh, as I've pulled it, I've sort of pulled it up and across, but my right hand slipped, but my left, my middle finger stayed where it was. Everything else slipped. I must've been holding onto it more with my middle finger than anything. <laughs> and it popped out. <laughs> I instantly thought I'd broke it. Um, and I just like pushed it back and it popped back in. And I thought, you've got to be kidding me. I thought, fucking hell, uh, I'm gonna have to go home. And I was laying trench as well. So I was trying to pick up trench. I was lo laying for myself. I was just working out of a bucket all day because um, I didn't really fancy knocking up boards all day. It was a hot day. I covered my money. Um, and my finger was sore as fuck, so I just, I went home. I'm, you know, a big advocate in fitness and health uh, when it comes to, you know, um, eating well and working out. I mean, I've had my work, first workout this morning, two minutes. <laughs> it's 10 past seven, Saturday morning. Um, I work out every day, pretty much twice a day. Uh, but it's not, I've, I've been trying to learn for years um, what's best for um, a bricklayer. You know, not, not, you know, bricklayers can go to the gym after work. It's not a big deal, but it depends on how hard you work at work. Uh, if you're a price worker and you want to make as much as you can, then going, getting home, getting ready, going to the gym, or even just going straight to the gym after and having a really, you know, an hour session in the gym um, will really fuck you up the next day. Um, you know, and you really, you lose your concentration, you're not, you, you feel weak, you feel tired. Um, and for years I've tried to find different ways of working out, you know, doing it all over the weekend, but then I'm fucked over the weekend. Uh, doing once a day, um, try not to work out too much, trying to get, I've tried loads of different ways to, to try and still be good at work. And the only way I've found personally is it's twice a day, but it's when I get up in the morning, I'll do two set of pull-ups, two set of push-ups, two set of stomach crunches, and two set of um, just standing squats with nothing on my back, just really deep, really up and down slow. Uh, and you know, just twice to failure on each and I'll go through the sets um, and it takes me pff, 10 minutes, 15 minutes tops and that'll be me done in the morning. And then after work, I'll get back. I won't, I won't have eaten all day and then I'll literally just jump straight back on it and do it again. And it works well for me, keeps me in pretty good shape. Um, I like, I've got a running machine now. I was doing 20 minutes run in the morning before work for a while but I was finding that my work was suffering, like my quantity of work was suffering quite a bit. I was finding it very hard to uh, find the motivation to, to push myself at work. I was, you know, just 
looking for any reason to sort of stand around halfway through the day because I've just, you know, because, well, doing a run before work and I was doing the run after work as well. Um, and, I, and it caught up with me um, and I just, I, for about two days, I just felt down. <laughs> so I knocked that on the head pretty quick. I've always done like, for the last couple of months, I've always done like an hour run on a Saturday morning, an hour run on a Sunday, um, which has put my fitness through the roof. Ask Amy. Look who's just get, uh, decided to join me in the workout, look. Come on, show us how many you can do. I've been teaching how to do pull-ups. Right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Come on then. All right, ready? Go on, girl, get it up. Get it up there. One. <laughs> Two. <laughs> do a few cheap ones. That's it, now jump up. That's it, lift down slow, jump up, go on, lift down slow, go on, go on. Right, I'm gonna finish my workout. Oh, oh now nah, come, oi, let me finish my workout first, come on. What? Let me finish my workout. Amy, hey, pack it in, stop doing, doing naughty moves. <sighs> I like listening to sort of drum and bass music when I run. It's one of my favourites at the minute. I'll restart that bad boy and get running. Well, that's annoying. I've done 20 minutes and I'm fucked. <laughs> no, I'm dead. Fuck knows, um, the fucking thing started to smell like it was burning. Cheap junk shit, look, and it's come off to the side. I tightened it up before we started. 
So fuck knows what's wrong with that. So I'm gonna get back to the old, uh, where's my skipping rope? Looks like skipping for the, uh, for the rest of the time. Skipping's much harder than running. <laughs> I've done 10 minutes. I'm a bit out of practice to be fair because I've been running for ages. I ain't really skipped in ages. Um, a bit gutted about the running machine, to be honest. I think it did say on the instructions, uh, it said something about it unaligning or something like that. So there must be a way to realign it and get it working again. But anyway, I'm all sweaty in that. So I'm gonna do my last set of pull-ups and push-ups and shit. Lemon and cucumber, this is what I drink at work. Lemon and cucumber, infused. We, Amy makes it for me. And what we do, right, there's loads of health benefits from it. I can't be asked to talk about it because I can never remember what it is exactly. But it's full of vitamin C, uh, which is very good for you, I know that. Um, yeah, this has been in fucking, what's the word? Fermenting. Fermenting since yesterday. I'm gonna add some extra water to it. But usually I, what I do is every morning without fail, I'll just work up, wake up, go downstairs, and uh... I have to have this to deal with Charlie all day. Charlie. It won't me. Yeah, usually every single morning without fail, uh, Amy makes me a, after I've had a workout, I'll come in and there'll be a, a full, fully squeezed lemon, I'll just flip, I fucking sweat on my face. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Himalayan pink salt. Um, it helps absorb the water as well, so you don't need to piss every five minutes. Did you know that for every one cup of coffee you have in the morning, you need five cups of water to um, balance out the dehydration it's gonna cause? So, I stopped drinking coffee a little while ago. How long have I been not drinking coffee for? A couple of months? Mm. I feel so much better at work. A uh, pint of lemon, sea salt, uh, Himalayan salt, and apple cider vinegar on an empty stomach. Then I'll have another pint of water on its own. I'll take that cup to work full of lemon and cucumber, fill it up. Uh, I drink one at 10, we have like a 10, 15 minute break. And then Amy fills it back with normal water uh, and then it ferments again. Amy does everything. I just lay the bricks. Even she does that now. <laughs> she, she's like a better version of me, 10 times better. Yeah, and then I have another drink like that and then I get home and we eat really healthy. Um, we have our slip ups, don't we? I do. Amy does. <laughs> I, I join her to make her not feel as bad, I swear. Amy's being reluctant to be on camera, ain't you? I've got my makeup on yet. You have got my makeup on yet? Saturday we do it. Oh yeah, because we do the sh mm. We do our weekly shop on a Saturday. Um, so what we do is, <clears throat> okay. have you got last week's dinner plan? Yep. She bought this fucking um, menu. <laughs> so, I, so I know what's for menu, but I still ask her anyway. So, menu, we had Monday, we had chicken mash and carrots, my favorite. Tuesday was meatballs and rice. Wednesday was chicken fire, potatoes and veg. Thursday was spag bowl, but I don't have um, spaghetti. spaghetti. I have rice with it. Or potatoes. Um, yeah, we didn't know. end up having these two dinners. We've still got them. Oh, we've still got them, yeah. have we? We can have one of them tonight then, can't we? Yeah, we can have jacket potatoes for lunch, maybe, with tuna. Yeah. 
And uh, what did we actually have yesterday? Chili con carne? No, we actually, uh, we rearranged it a bit because we didn't have dinner one day. We just had watermelon. Oh, right. So last night we only had this, so we've still got Oh, right. Well, dinners. spag bowl, I have chips with it. It looked like dirty fries. It was fucking amazing. I swear to God, spag bowl with uh, homemade chips underneath. Mmm, <whistles> mama. So we've decided we're gonna have a barbecue today and a barbecue tomorrow to cook the food. So we've got a load of let's frozen stuff left over. So what are we gonna have today? We are going to have pork shoulder steaks. Pork shoulder steaks. Uh, oh, and I also get these sausages as well, the heck ones, 97%. And I'll make a fruit um, platter up. I need a shave as well, it's looking a bit ginger pube face. Oh my god, it stinks. <laughs> what? It stinks. Fuck off. <laughs> so yeah, as I was saying, they're gluten, dairy free, they're 97% pork. If you like sausages, again, I'll say it again. Mate, look at the back of the package. Some of them are like 40% pork. They're full of wheat, loads of shite. Hello? What do you fucking, fuck what the fuck do you want? What the fuck are you doing answering the phone? <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> right, you up to? Uh, yeah, you can pop around if you want. <laughs> Talk to me, you can! <laughs> uh. <laughs> no. I'm going to get my face on. You're going to put your face on? <laughs> and tonight, <laughs> what was that? What was that program? Tonight, Matthew, we had no. What was it? All right, I've got to go do her fucking eyebrows and her nails. <laughs> cool as fuck, me, bruh. Not even that bad. Yeah, because you did them. Put the brave face on for the camera, you know. Yeah. Ah. I think my hands are sweating on your face. Yeah. I think so too. <laughs> I don't know if you're sweaty or... Mm. Ow! That was a big one. Yeah, that was a big one. Oh, that fucking hurt. <laughs> Fuck me, you're making me sweat, Keith. <laughs> I need I have my cold shower. Oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> I snapped a toenail, so... Huh? I snapped a toenail, so they might be hard to paint. Why don't you sit on there? You're so sweaty. I oh, know. I need my shower. I know. It's on here. It's there waiting for you. Oh. Mm -hmm. In shower, and am I? <laughs> Amy's moaning. I'm sweating a lot. Fuck. So I need to have a shower. Show everyone your toes. Come on. I'm sure there'll be some foot fetish people out there that want to see them. What do you think of my? That my... oh, was so close. It's fucking. Well, fucking come here, look. Come here. Come here. Look at him. 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 Uh, look at them little wonky fuckers. <laughs> They're like E.T.'s fucking fingers. Wait. Amy. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. You can always tell if Amy's had a shower before me. Look, if I turn it on, for some reason I don't, I don't know why, but she always uses this one. She says it feels better or something. I use that one, but she uses that one. Fuck knows why. Come on, Amy, show us your dress, kiss a swell. Kiss a swell. Doo -doo. Dad's chatting her up, look. <laughs> Do you blame me, Dad? <laughs> I was down upstairs and all I could hear is, oh, hello. <laughs> Fuck off, Dad, stop chatting my girlfriend up. Oh, I'm going to stay at this table. You need to read Yeah. Oh, this is trans of us. We're both playing Alexa. Whoever fucking loses. Yeah, I'm trying. Are you breaking the night? That's it. Let's make this official. Right. Oh, it's sticky. Look at this, love. Oh, <coughs> oh, no. Is it going past? <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, he's in. <laughs> Two 
watch this YouTube. He's going to bend it. Can we go now? Yes, we can go now. Oh, that is nice and cold. Hello, stinky. Hello, stinky. Oh. Yes. Boris. Boris. Hello, boy. Hello. 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 Oh. Are they in? Are they edible yet? Look at it. Oh, yeah, there's loads of red ones. I know. We want them a bit more darkly purple than red. Another week. Right, again, another couple of weeks. Oh, that looks like a purple one. Up there, look. The cherries are ready. <sighs> you need to wash it and get the bugs out. Mm. Don't spit out me because I'm wearing white. Amy's well impressed with my toenail painting skills, isn't you? Yeah. That'll, be, that'll be 30 pounds, please. <laughs> Anyone want a foot pick? <laughs> yeah, I know. Get it with Scanner, top scanner. Boop. Boop. This is the curry. Oh. Oh. That's the shop done. 155 quid. Ugh. I mean, we did grab her mum some bits and uh I always grab my granddad some microwave meals. I don't think they're great, to be honest, but he don't like cooking and just helps him out a bit. So, oh, what did I get him actually? What we got? We got some bangers. We got got him bangers and mash. We got him barbecue chicken and jasmine rice. Uh, chicken charmaine. Yeah, I know, I want them myself. I know. Braised beef and mash. What else we got? I don't know, just run them over. Shepherd's pie. Um, and some sweet and sour chicken with egg fried rice. Looks fucking asleep, that. 
fucking sound though, look. <laughs> it's fucking sound though. Oh, there he is, look. <laughs> <laughs> Girl is looking gorgeous today, ain't ya? You ain't looking like no man bricklayer today, are ya? Huh? Look beautiful there, yeah. <laughs> old CC, look, inscribed in it. Me old, me old case, look, brings back memories, that. Your dress keeps floating up, huh? <laughs> you just give the whole street a bloody show of your ass. I knew all my working out was for a reason. <laughs> Should we go down now? No. Please. No. See, this man don't let me go nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> That's bullshit. <laughs> you can go wherever you want. Here's what we use. It's instant light. Lumpwood charcoal. Fuck her stuff. She's cooking. She's cooking. It's bought myself a new little barbecue set, look. 15 quid, B and Q, B and M. <laughs> Probably last five minutes. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on, have a look. Got some burgers on the go, some burnt sausages. Oh, lovely. We all, like our, we all like our sausages cremated on a barbecue, don't we? It's not the most easiest barbecue to navigate, but it does the job. Fuck, it's hot. Mmm. Mmm. Yummy. It's hot, Amy. <laughs> Got the old pork chops on there now. Lovely. My hair. It's getting long, isn't it? What do you think of my hair, Amy? Lovely darling. Tap piss. I, I used to have really long hair, like literally down to the middle of my back, I reckon. I'll show you a picture back when I was a model. Oh my god, I didn't know you were recording. Nah. <laughs> Am I allowed to put that up while I just see? No. The old lifting of the dress. No, that's for OnlyFans only. <laughs> no, we don't have an OnlyFans if you're asking. Okay. Secret one. Uh, Dripping that. Dripping. Oh, fly. Mmm. Mmm. Cooked to perfection. Mmm. Amy's saving room for the pork chops, so I've had three burgers, <laughs> five sausages, <laughs> and now I've got probably one pork chop for Amy and another five for me. Because <laughs> I ain't a bit fast. I eat once a day, well, in like a period. I'll eat like probably three plates worth of dinner, but I'll eat it. We both do, don't we? Mm hmm. We both eat it like over like three hours or something like that. I don't like care if anyone else does it, but I'm one of these people that if I think something makes me feel better and it helps me in life, I like to just share it, you know, whether it's right or wrong. I don't know, but, you know, I've tried and tested loads of different things in my life so far, and I'm sure I'll try a lot more different things, you know, and I'm sure what I might think's right now, I might think's wrong in a year's time. I don't know, but I just, you know, if I find something that I find sounds like common sense and it works and I feel good from it, then I like to just pass it on. And that's why I like, you know, with my Brickland channel, that's why I like saying what I know even though I don't know everything and I never will um, the things that I do learn I'll always try and help other people learn as well <laughs> Oi, put them knickers away <laughs> now my hair's up oh your hair's up yeah. it's alright eat over the edge I can't I got over you my can. leg you can you ain't it's alright it's covered mm, yeah. give your mouth around a girl <laughs> lovely bit of watermelon she couldn't be asked to eat any more pork tops. I think she's all meated out. Have, have you had enough meat for today? Do you want some more later? More later, please. Oh, look at that. Yeah, baby. <gasps> it's going to be hot, isn't it? Fuck that, it's too hot. Ah! What are you doing? Ah! <laughs> I'm 
trying to snap it. <sighs> now I can get my mouth on it. <laughs> hey, let's have a day talk, please. Meat or fruit? What do you think we're supposed to eat? Fruit. Yeah. What do you lot think? In the comments below. What we're supposed to eat? Like me personally, I love meat. I've tried to be vegan, but I just love meat. Um, could I kill an animal? Um, if I had to, uh, I could. I wouldn't want to. Mm. I tell you this for nothing. I'm eating this and this. I eat that. And don't get me wrong, it's lovely. But when you get your mouth into a nice juicy bit of fucking watermelon like that, I think I've tried pretty much every diet going. Um, all meat, vegan, vegetarian, um, intermittent fasting, keto. Uh, fuck knows what else is there. Mono, you heard of a mono diet? Mono is where you pick something you want to eat, like watermelon or steak, and you just eat that. If I had to pick one thing to eat for the rest of my life, it would probably be watermelon. Or mango, actually. I fucking love mango. They're one of the clean 15. If you don't know what that is, that's... So you get... Um, a lot of people eat a lot of fruits and stuff like that. But... So uh, big food companies can mass produce it and stuff like that. They have to cover it in pesticides um, to stop animals eating it, basically. Little bugs and shit like that. And uh, the pesticides are pretty much linked to... <coughs> all sorts of long-term diseases like Alzheimer's and everything like that, pesticides, because basically what they're doing is they're spraying the foods with something that is killing, like, a, you know, a bug. It might only be a bug, but it's killing it. So what the fuck do you think? You know, like strawberries, they're one of the worst you can eat. I'm always moaning at you and I, Amy, for yeah. eating non-organic. Because I eat, if I, can, if I can't get something organic, I won't eat it. I know people can't afford organic because it's more expensive than that, but... Have a little look yourself up on um, on the internet what pesticides do to the human body and they literally, strawberries are literally balls of pesticides that you're eating if they're not um, organic. <laughs> Amy's at it again look, I bought some little uh, special dumbbell, some dump, some <coughs> push ups bars, come on in Amy, show us what you've got, come on Amy, come on girl, one, <laughs> try it again, take two. Let me try. Alright, let's see if we can get me on your back. Probably fucking not, you fat bastard. Candles, and I thought, do you know what? I want a candle, so I got one. I'm just thinking my candle. Lovely, isn't it? Reminds me of Amy that way, like that. Yeah. I'm never going to light it, or well, at least when it gets to the bum, I'll stop. Why is that not charged? Rack them up, buddy! Rack them up. Rack it up. My old cue, look. Hey, it's an old boy. I've still got some chalk there from fucking 20 years ago. Is there a bit of wind? You put it wherever you want. I'm still gonna miss, aren't I? Yeah, it'll be alright. Let me redo that, please. Let me redo that, please. <laughs> <laughs> I've got all... <laughs> right, try again. Yeah. Bit harder, girl, oh, bit harder. Right, right. <laughs> no, no. I'm getting another shot. What, so not only did you cheat, you got another <laughs> shot? It's going to be a fun game. <laughs> <laughs> you really want to put your hand there? Put your chin over the queue, look. Watch the, where, where the queue's going. Put your chin over the queue. <laughs> 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 
So. Snookered! Oh, oh. 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 Totally meant that! That's a stripe. It's not a stripe. <laughs> no, don't cheat. Don't cheat. Amy's decided she wants her own pool cue and we're going to get a darts table. A darts <laughs> table? A darts board. We're going to have a game of darts. And pool. And pool. Cheat and them chill, watch film, and then uh, bedtime. <laughs> bedtime. Oh. We got a badminton set. Me <laughs> 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 Oh, something's right in my eyes here. That's why you put me on this side, isn't it? Yeah. Fucking hell. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm too competitive. <laughs> I'm getting sweaty. You're getting sweaty, yeah? yeah. No! <laughs> Stop trying, trying to beat it up and hit it. Look at my hair. Oh. <laughs> I swear down. You're taking it. I swear it's like... I'm not! <laughs> Amy, hold it there. Look, hold it, Amy. Hold it above and just do that. Okay. <laughs> Getting on a bit, seven o'clock. This is time for our little sleeps movie. We have it every day without fail. It's full of melatonin, which uh, any of you don't know what melatonin is, it's the hormone that helps you sleep. Um, something like that, anyway. Look it up if you're interested. Lemon. 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 And what else do we have? Banana. 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 You get some weird ass motherfucking dreams on this stuff as well. It's like you live another life. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. It's like such vivid, weird fucking dreams. I love it. Give me that melatonin drink. Your water. How's the uh, cupboard? How's the fridge looking? Empty. Is all the meat we got? Is that all the meat we got? Yeah, and there's, uh. some, there's some chicken in the freezer as well. Get it away from the dress. We like to drink with Amy because Amy is our mate. And when we drink with Amy, she does it all in eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. <sighs> Two. <laughs> we like to drink with Charlie because Charlie is our mate. And when we drink with Charlie, he does it all in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <sighs> <laughs> it's about the closest thing to we're having a drink this weekend. Stop that. Come back here, sexy mama. You're looking damn fine. Looking like a woman. I'm like a woman. No, <laughs> it's Sunday. I didn't get food poisoning. So yeah, his dad, uh, dad and uh, step mum is coming around. We're going to go out for some breakfast this morning. I don't usually eat in the morning, um, but sometimes... 
you have to if it's uh, socializing, I suppose. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm not gonna video anything for today. We're gonna just relax and chill out today. Uh, it's Sunday. Um, I really can't be asked to do anything today. And, well, just editing this video for you. So if you enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. Hope to see you in the next one.